Hi guys, coming on here to talk about something that uh, recently just came over me. Um, one night I was pretty much hanging out by my altar. I lit some of my I lit my altar candle and I lit some incense and I pretty much just felt the urge to make jar protection for my home. Now I don't know what you want to call this or not. I like to in my head I'm like automatic witchcraft or automatic magic. Um, pretty much I just got a hair at my butt, went to my altar, dig through all my herbs, look at them. I pretty much touched most of my herbs, if not look in the jar, and just felt like this is right, this is wrong. Um, this is, I, I, this, I felt like it, no, yes, yes. It was all of these feelings were just coming through me, and I was just like, basically I grabbed you know, some lavender, looked at it, oh yeah, lavender definitely is going in here, because hello, I love lavender. Then I looked at freaking, um, High John the Conqueror, and I'm like, no, this doesn't feel right. Basically, I was just going through my herbs, and uh, all my little knickknacks, and just felt like what, what should have been in this jar of protection, and what shouldn't be. And I put sand in there, and, um, and I put in like, I put in a little bit of, uh, you know, beach water, or ocean water, I put a little bit of ocean water in there, I put a little bit of rain water from here. I try to connect, um, I try to connect with things that, that are related within my area here, into it. I'm like, wow, this feels right, this feels right, this feels wrong. And it was amazing. It was the spontaneity <laughs> of what, spontaneity witchcraft, and it was like, it was, I don't know, it just, there's like so many words that I want to like label this, but they're so, they don't do justify with, with that emotion I had that night. And um, I lit up a candle, uh, a purple candle, a little chime candle, and I basically parked it inside the jar and lit it within the jar, and it was amazing because it felt right, it felt power, it felt, it felt like I said it with motion, and, and it's in there. And it's gonna work. So I did that, and I um, and I won't tell you what I did with it afterwards because that's kind of like a personal thing. But it was amazing. Uh, it was just amazing. And I don't know what we want to call it. Is it is it called automatic witchcraft? Is it just called a magical hair up your butt? Um, is it just called like a unicorn stab from its horn into your arm and just all of a sudden you're like, okay, I gotta do this. I don't know what you want to call it. Pretty much, it was just like automatic witchcraft. Has this ever happened to you guys? Has it, have you ever got that that magical whim, that magical breeze up your ass, and you just decided to go, "Hey, I need to do this," and I don't care what what my book says. I, don't, I really don't care what this says. I don't really care what what I need to do. I don't care about the formality or the, form the the structure of this ritual and I have to do it this way. To me this felt natural and to me this felt real. Has this ever happened to you where you kind of kind of block all the knowledge that you read in your bo in, in books and, and got some theories from people and just like push it away and actually just dove in and did it your own? Has this ever happened to you? Because this happens to me every like four years, I swear, it's like a blue moon thing. It only happens so often, and when it does, it's like, ah, power. This is, this is, this is what keeps me hooked on Wicca. This is what, this is what fuels me. So, if this makes sense to you guys, leave comments down below, or some video responses. And I know you can't attach video responses to people, but if you put my name on video responses, I will find it, and I will watch the video and I would like it and I will comment it and everything. That is my goal today is actually research some videos that's connected to me with my name and hopefully I can find some. So yeah. So till then guys, thank you for watching and subscribing like always. Let's be.